Hi everyone! Welcome to Technic4 Tutorials. In this video, I'll show you how to set up emails in CloudFunnels. Let's begin! CloudFunnels supports all SMTPs like Gmail, Yahoo, SendGrid, Mailgun, Office 365, and more. And you can add your own server SMTP. CloudFunnels has two systems in place for outgoing emails. First is the default posting mailer which sends emails but with some limitations. The recommended and generally preferred method for sending emails is through SMTP. SMTPs give a better deliverability because professional SMTP services have a better chance of getting your mail to the recipient's inbox. This is generally preferred default PHP mailer, which may not always be a whitelist admin server. SMTPs, on the other hand, are also customizable and has a huge power and widely used professionally. And CloudFunnels works easily with the best SMTP providers, including Amazon, Gmail, and Office 365. So let me show you how you would add your SMTPs. First, on the sidebar section, click on Email Marketing. Then, select SMTPs. First, I'll show you how to add Gmail in CloudFunnels, and I will show you two methods on adding Gmail. For the first method, click on the Create New button. Add in the title, add in your SMTP host, and to get the SMTP host, SMTP port, and encryption, go to your Gmail. Open a new tab, and here is my Gmail. On the top right section, click on the cogwheel, which is your settings. Then click on See All Settings. And on the subheader, click on Forwarding and POP slash IMAP. Then scroll down and click on Configuration Instructions. And when you're there, click on Step 2. Change SMTP and other settings in your email client. Then you will see the outgoing mail SMTP server. This is the host name. Copy it, then paste it on the SMTP host. And for our SMTP port and encryption, copy TLS and paste it on encryption. And for the port, you will see port for TLS slash start TLS. Copy these digits and paste it on your SMTP port. Then enter in your from name and your email ID. For mine, this is my email ID. And for your username, again add in your email ID. Then, enter in your email password. Enter in your reply name and your reply email ID. And after that, what you'll need to do is open another tab, click on your Google account, and select Manage your Google account. Then on the side section, Click on Security. Scroll down and on Less Secure App Access, turn it on to allow less secure apps. And after that, open another tab and type in Display Unlock Captcha. Then click here where it will take you to accounts.google.com. To display unlock captcha then click on continue then after that go back to your smtp setup and save your settings now that it is added let's test this gmail smtp click on the i button enter the to name to email the email title, buddy, then select debug on, then click on send email, 
And now you will see the debugged data where I have sent it successfully. And if I check this email, you can see here I have received the email. And that is the first method in adding Gmail SMTP. Now let me show you the second method. Again, click on Create New. Enter in the title. And for the SMTP host, port, and encryption, it will be the same as the first one. So you can just go ahead and copy those and paste it here. Now add in the from name and your default from mail. You can also use the email ID you've used before. And for your username, as the default from mail. So you can just copy that and paste it here on your username. So here comes the second method. What you'll need to do is open another tab and click on your user. Then select Manage your Google account. And again, on the sidebar section, click on Security. Scroll down and on Two-Step Verification, turn it on. Click on Get Started and enter in your password to verify. Then click on Next. Add in your phone number. And after that, click on App Passwords. Again, enter in your email ID password to verify. Then select the app. Click on Other for a custom name. Then add in your app name, Cloud Funnels. Then click on Generate. Now you will see your app password for your device. Copy it and paste it back here. After that, add in your reply name and your reply email. Then save your settings. And now the second method is added. And to test it, again click on the I button. Then fill in the details for it, like earlier, like the name, email, email title, body, and turn the debug on. Then send your email. And here you will see I have sent it successfully. To check it, go to your email. And now you will see I have received the email for the second method. And one more thing to remember. If you have enabled the two-step verification for the second method, then your previous email will not work. So this first SMTP setup we have made will no longer work. So you can just delete it. And if you're using the two-step verification, your less secure app will not work. So you can just choose between the two methods you want to use. And that is how easy it is to set up your emails in Cloud Funnels. Thank you for watching and see you on the next one.